Hey guys, this is F Fan Crazy from MagicLeague.com, and um, I'm here to show you uh, how to do the question that I think everybody asks every day in the channel. How do you play Magic at Magic League? Well, I'm about to show you. All right. So what you're gonna want to do first is you're gonna get this program called Magic Workstation. So just Google Magic Workstation, and off we go. Alright, so go to magicworkstation.com, as you can see here, and what you're going to want to do is you're going to download the evaluation version. Don't listen to what any anyone else says, the evaluation version is all you will ever need to play at Magic League. Alright, so you're going to click that link right there, and it's going to prompt you. Any second now. Alright. So after prompts you, you're going to want to save it. Um, doesn't really matter where you save it, just wherever. Uh, I just saved mine to the desktop. And get rid of all those. Alright. Alright, and now the installation wizard comes up, and you're going to hit I accept. And you're going to probably want to install this to program files. Um, and I'm not creating a desktop shortcut because I actually already have this installed. I'm just showing it to you guys. So, But you guys can make a desktop icon and a quick start. Alright, so let it install and then you can just hit next and you can launch Magic Workstation. Alright, so Magic Workstation, like I said, the evaluation version, you can ignore that, that it won't pop up for you. Alright, so now you're gonna pop up like this. Every time you open Magic Workstation you have to wait five seconds. That's about the only thing that matters when it's not free. Or when it, yeah, when it's free. And you get tips, but I don't put those on, so to close out of that. Alright, so now you get to this, and you're going to notice, after I resize the window here, alright, you're going to notice that, well, that doesn't look like a magic card. Well, that that's because it isn't. That's because it comes with this game that doesn't even have any rules, because, well, it just doesn't, and they're not real cards. So, you're like, oh, well, how am I going to do that? How am I going to play if I don't have any real cards? Alright. First, you want to switch to deck edit mode there. Go to view deck edit mode because it's just so much easier. And if you just do it now, you're going to save yourself a whole lot of headaches. Alright, so as you can see, these aren't real cards. Not a lot of these make any sense. So what you're going to do is minimize out of that. And you're going to go here and you're going to go to slightlymagic.com. Slightly magic. And click the link. Click OK. Click on the link here, and it'll bring you to Slightly Magic. Alright, so now, you're going to have to update your master base, which is what we're about to download, every time a new set comes out. And you're probably going to want to go here. See at the bottom it says Zendikar Master Base? You want to click on the Master Base file. Whenever a new set comes out, you got to re-download the Master Base so you can get your new sets. Alright, you need WinRAR, so if you don't have that, go ahead and download it. It's not that hard to figure out. And click Download the Master Base. And you're going to want to open it with WinRAR. Alright. Now, WinRAR, you're going to go here, hit X out of that. Again, you only need evaluation version of this. Now, you're going to want to extract this to the same file, the same folder that you installed MWS in. So it's probably going to be C, uh, Program Files, and then Magic Workstation. Um, and that's the easiest way to do it. However, yeah, you can just install anywhere in that folder. However, my computer hates me. So you're going to say yes to all. My computer hates me and never lets me install anything, even though I have permission to. So I always have to install it to my desktop and then manually move it there. Um, you may or may not have to do this, but it doesn't really matter as long as the files get to where they need to go. So I'm going to open up Program Files and magic workstation right there all right so magic workstation then i just take minimize that for a second i'm gonna move that all right now i'm just gonna drag these into here and you're gonna want to replace whatever is already there this is Anytime you reinstall the master base, you just want to move and replace and replace all of the existing folder files. 
Do it again for the history. And one last time for the master base itself. Alright, so once you get this far, you're pretty much almost there. Alright, so what you're going to do next is you can close out a winter R. You don't need that. Alright, go open Magic Workstation again. You're going to want to go to File. You're going to click on the left side because otherwise you're going to edit the deck. And you're going to open Libraries. Open Libraries. Alright, and then you're going to want to just install it anywhere in here. Or open it from here, rather. Alright, so you open the file, and look, we have real cards! Alright, so right now there's you know, 16,000 cards, so if you don't have that many, if you don't recognize any of the cards, then you didn't do it right. But you should have a long, long, long list of cards. Alright, now the last thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to assign the default master base to this. That way, every time you open Magic Workstation, it will automatically go to that default base instead of back to the other one every time you open it. Um, you, you probably don't have to do it because you just replaced the original one, which was the weird cards, but it's you know just easier to do it that way. Alright, like I said, you can ignore that. And like I said, you can, like I have a, you can see on the bottom I actually have a desktop icon, but that's because I just installed this again to show you guys how to do it. Alright, so wait the five seconds. Okay. And okay, we already have the master base. Okay. So get this resized here. Alright, now that's all for this tutorial. On uh, the next tutorial we're gonna show you how to make a deck. And that's about it. This is F Fan Crazy from MagicLeague.com.